Hi guys, I'm Rachel Gujar here at the Feed Feed and today we're making curried Hasselback potatoes. Okay, this recipe is super simple and easy, perfect for the holiday season, so let's start. Slicing a bit off at the bottom on one side, so to make sure that the potato is secure. And now, I'm going to use these two chopsticks as my guide so that I don't cut all the way through the potato. Nice little slices here. Don't know where it originated from, but maybe we can Google that once I'm done slicing. So I'm going to go ahead and do this to all of my other potatoes and place them on a sheet pan. All right, and we're gonna chop up some garlic. Okay, so I am using curry powder, obviously. All of my fellow Indian homies. <laughs> I know we don't use curry powder back in India, but I discovered it after moving here, and it's pretty awesome, I have to say. So, I like it. Everybody here likes it. I think you should try it. Add some olive oil. A little bit of garlic to flavor this. Kosher salt. Give all of this a good little mix with a whisk. And we're going to brush our potatoes with this delicious uh, garlicky curry olive oil. So these are ready to go in the oven at 350 for about an hour. We're gonna pull them out at the 30 minute mark and brush them again with some olive oil and put them back in. And now we're going to put this back in the oven for another 45 minutes. We're gonna brush again at the one hour mark and put it in for 15. So our potatoes are almost ready. While that's happening, I'm gonna go ahead and prep our herbs. And just a little bit of parsley. I can't remember where I saw this trick, but you can just do that. That's how they cut my hair. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> Layering. And then save this for stock. Look how crispy the bottom gets. That is delicious. All right guys, so there you have it. Curried Hasselback potatoes. This is a super simple holiday side dish or just a weeknight dinner if you wanna make one. Nice and golden on the top, crispy, crunchy bottoms. Thanks to GE for outfitting Feed Feed Brooklyn with GE Profile Smart Appliances. If you want the recipe, go to thefeedfeed.com and I'll see you again next time.